Find a boat and drive out into the middle of nowhere. Pull out your phone and dial 911. Nico quickly realizes he can't actually tell the operator where his emergency is. Where would you like us to send an officer? I don't know where I am exactly. I'll call you when I can figure it out. Where am I? That's a good question. I'll call back when I see a landmark. I knew you'd ask that. Let me call you back when I know exactly where I am. We look forward to hearing from you again. Please stay safe in the meantime. And if you didn't know, Nico would otherwise have no problem in naming the area. Where would you like us to send an officer? Hov Beach. An LCPD peacekeeper will be there as soon as possible, sir. The player has a lot of unused dialogue. For example, Nico could buy drugs. You gonna hook me up, pal? Search dead bodies. Oh, you're too kind. And play video games with friends. Let's play some games, then. I'll talk to you in the comments section about my theories on how these were intended to be used. Nico was also meant to react to getting shot at in cover. I'm gonna die here. Giving homeless people money. Take this, my friend. Or not giving homeless people money. Not now, friend. And even when taking ice cream trucks. Stealing ice cream trucks? What is wrong with me? Traffic stops are conducted in certain parts of the world and they're quite the detailed scene. As you can see a cop finishing his search. I've also seen him take place here on the Eastboro Bridge. It's just really impressive to see these play out quite realistically with the traffic cones and whatnot. And it's the same inside the booth tunnel connecting Alderney and Algonquin. They'll usually perform a quick boot check before letting them go. GTA 4 was meant to feature snow, and this is what it might have looked like. There's evidence of this in several files, and I really wish Rockstar could have made it happen. It would have been amazing to watch the city streets gradually fill with snow. We can assume civilians might have wore warmer clothes during this weather, just like the way police do when it rains in the vanilla game. If you've not played around with the snow mods, then I highly, highly recommend it. Of course, there's a link in the description. People will be brutally injured and killed in car crashes, unlike the player. You may have noticed that sometimes people die on impact. And sometimes they go unconscious. And other times they're set on fire. The mission Snowstorm reveals something completely unknown about Noose. When they arrived to break up the drug deal, you probably never noticed how they abseiled down from the helicopter. If we slow down time and get a close-up with free cam, you can fully see it in action. These dudes also have unused dialogue, which leads me to believe it was meant to function in free modes too. Look out below, motherfuckers! Surprise, motherfuckers! Go, go, go! Unit 5, we are go! Like in the f movies. Oh yeah, this is why I joined Noose. Surviving a 5 or 6 star wanted level is already a big challenge in GTA 4, but the Algonquin police snipers make it even harder. You often can't see them, let alone fight back due to their crazy height advantage, and they'll quickly incapacitate your vehicle. So watch out for these boys. They are usually positioned in high-end areas of Algonquin, defending places like the Bank of Liberty City. If you're playing on the Ballad Gay Tony, get a 5 star wanted level and use the explosive sniper cheat code. Yeah, it's f***ing ridiculous. You're actually gonna need the tank to survive now, as long as they don't blow themselves up. Oh. People can actually stop the cars and get out, meaning they don't just drive around at random. For example, some will park at businesses, They'll park at their workplace. They'll park back home. And of course they'll use parking spaces all the same. Other times you may see bikers dropping off passengers at the side of the road. Some richer neighborhoods have opening garage doors. They can also be parked into. The player can respawn at Shotland Medical Center, Cerveza Heights, 
Bohan Medical and Tintal, Eastern Medical, North Holland, North Tudor, and West Dyke Memorial. But did you ever notice the mysterious unused hospital in City Hall? From the back end it's unmistakable, with the ambulances of course. And just imagine spawn in here, Star Junction is conveniently up the road. If you want to grab a chopper, Higgins Heli Tours are around the corner. And if you travel by train, based, you've got quick access to the subway system. We can only really speculate about why this location was cut. Fighting is really fun and satisfying in GTA 4. Some people are clearly more skilled and it shows in how they throw a punch. Getting beat up sometimes is just part of the experience. Did you know that cops, criminals, bouncers and laborers are most of the best fighters in the game? And older pedestrians are actually weaker than the young. With that being said, let's go run a couple tests in game. I've recruited this tough guy over here and we're going to use him to go beat up an elderly man. Yeah. Now let's see what happens. Didn't stand the chance. Okay, but now on the flip side, let's put him up against someone of equal skill. As you can see, that was much more balanced. He did win, but you know, could have went either way. Pedestrians will visit ATMs to withdraw cash, which the player can then steal. Compared to the average person carrying 10, 20, 30 dollars, they drop a lot more money. I think it's the same with prostitutes you after you buy their goods. Even better are the armored trucks, which can be blown up and the ground will be scattered with cash you can pick up. We all know that vehicle cameras can be adjusted and you have the option of many different perspectives, but did you know you can do the same thing when aiming a gun? Or fighting an NPC? Riding the train? Getting a lap dance? I'd go in and show you, but YouTube took the video down last time. Watching TV. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Even when getting a car wash. Did you know hookers can't get into certain vehicles, like a forklift? I think this car might be a bit small. Or a bus. Damn, this ain't the right car for that sh Or a bike. Sh this car's too small for that. Or a boat. As flexible as you are, lady. We can't do that in here. They actually won't get into any police cars either, which makes perfect sense, of course. Wind actually exists in GTA 4, and it's most noticeable during a thunderstorm. Like how it carries steam from the grid here. Or the exhaust fumes from a car. And even the heat of Nico's breath. If we create a side by side, you can see how the steam from food stands changes direction. To feed our meat. Or the embers of a fire barrel. Traffic lights will also swing back and forth. Trees will sway in the wind. And the sea turns violent. Here are some more details you probably never knew about GTA 4. And uh, thanks for watching till the end.